Are you serious? It's time to go live, 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 live. Right now. Prime time live. Welcome to the coming apocalypse. Evangelist and pastor Paul Bagley will take you on a journey into the end times prophecy. He'll examine current world events and explain how they relate to the end times. For decades, Pastor Bakley has provided people all over the world with an understanding of today's world events from a biblical perspective. Now, here's your host, Pastor Paul Bakley. Are you serious? Are you serious, folks? Let's, uh, let's just take a look at this right now and say welcome to Primetime Live. There's a lot going on, and it's getting critical. I mean, there's a curfew in the fourth largest city in America. This is the closest thing to martial law that you can get. And 12,000 Texas National Guard soldiers are on the streets helping tonight. And every ounce of energy that the law enforcement can muster is out there tonight, as well as an unbelievable, uh, unbelievable general public of folks from all across Texas and surrounding states that have been sent in to help. Uh, there's no question, the miracles have been happening. The, the death toll is so low, it's incomprehensible considering the fact that this is a flood of biblical proportion. Uh, this is a flood that we've never seen before. Matter of fact, 49 inches of rain, the most ever dropped on the mainland of the United States of America since this became a republic. And it comes, it, the storm hit. Hurricane Harvey, battle ready, came ashore at Corpus Christi, Texas. That represents, of course, the body of Christ and bringing with it everything it's got. But I'm telling you, five days after the total solar eclipse, the harbinger of God, the warning of a time to come, a time like we've never witnessed before, three prophetic signs, the total solar eclipse, and then S September 23rd on the Feast of Trumpets, we'll have the Revelation 12 constellation alignment. Never before has it happened. Never again will it ever happen. And that alignment, without question, is going to reveal to us two major wonders in heaven. A woman representing Israel, clothed with the Son of God and the moon under her feet, I believe, representing Islam. The 12 stars representing the 12 tribes of Israel being brought together in the year of its 70th anniversary. It's coming on May the 14th, 2018. We're in the 70th year. And while all of this is happening, there's another wonder. Why is the woman being empowered? Why is she being clothed in the sun with authority over the moon? Why is she in this? And how will she be protected from the roaring dragon, the red dragon in Revelation 12, that will try to devour the man-child? Of course, we know that's not Jesus Christ. He's already come before. This is prophetic. This is the body of Christ. Corpus Christi, the warning's here. But we have the overcomer. We have all overcome by the word of our testimony and the blood of the Lamb. Having said that, let's take a look at the current world events and how they, uh, how they literally uh, are tied to the biblical narrative, the prophetic word of God that is indescribable, incomprehensible, <laughs> infallible, the prophetic, powerful word of the Lord. Can somebody shout amen? I want to welcome all of you that are live with us tonight at Periscope. Everybody live at New Livestream, Roku Satellite Television. Also, all of you at publiclyprophecy.com. All of you with the Publicly Prophecy app, watching on your iPhones and Androids. All of you that are also with us at YouTube Live. Oh, man, I'm telling you, what a great crowd of folks we have. What a great cloud of witnesses that we're gathering in tonight. We've got a lot to cover. It is true. There's a chemical plant tonight about ready to explode. And there's nothing we can do to prevent it 
but pray. What? That is huge, okay? But it's true. It's happening. Are we buzzing? We got static? We have static. You've got to be kidding me, right? We have static. We have static. All right, guys, there's only one thing I can do. I have to shut down the program and bring it back up, and the static will be gone. So if you all will just wait, give me two to three minutes, I will fix it. Wow. Thank you, guys. I'm sorry I was in a, I was moving right along. Shutting down.